All right. Okay. Okay. Um, I was one of the protesters that was outside Occupy Melbourne yesterday morning from 8:30 in the morning. I uh, one of the protesters. We couldn't get in to support the people inside because they fenced everyone off. Uh, after the police went in and broke through the protesters that were securing the kitchen and the indigenous space with gr such great force and violence and dragging people away, all of the protesters combined together on the corner of Collins and Swanston Street. Um, Dave Karen, one of the union representatives, gave a speech. Uh, there were hundreds of people in that intersection. Uh, and as he finished his speech, the cops took him down and just started to charge all of the people that were in the intersection. It was about three rows behind um, of three rows of people. There were hundreds of people behind us pushing. No one had anywhere to move. The, the horses were just pushing into the crowd. We were all compressed together. There was people like we couldn't breathe and we're trying to get them to stop pushing. And, and that completely happened without warning and pushed us all back on to divide to sections of the protest to be on both sides of Collins and then the rest to be down the other end of Swanson Street and then they began to push us as a mobile mosh pit down the street and at one point they tried to kettle us in and come down the other end of Swanson Street which the protest moved to Little Collins Street where we then diverted traffic from that street into the police which broke their barriers which then enabled the protesters to keep peacefully moving down to the corner of Burke and Swanston. Um, it was really quite full on to see the police brutality. I saw 